Hi. Welcome to Just Trading. In this video, our team give you an analysis with the information we got after the closing day of October 17, 2022. Our objective is to give you suggestions to trade with less risk and higher capital return. Remember to stop the video at any time, if you want to look at it carefully. Here, we show you an example of the stock's timestamp that you can find on the video's comments. You can click on the timestamp and go to the stock's details. SP500 ETF belongs to the trade high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Dow Jones Industrial ETF belongs to the trade high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. NASDAQ 100 ETF belongs to the trade high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Corporate bond ETF belongs to the bear low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the market sectors table. There is a strong opportunity to buy real estate sector EDF. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 4.0%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $39.38. For a vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell financial sector EDF. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 2.5%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $31.68. For a vertical put option, an estimated price is at $0.48. Energy sector ETF belongs to the bull normal class. Today. Our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of energy sector. There is a weak opportunity to buy Marathon Petroleum. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 7.0%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $106.2. For a vertical call option, an estimated price is at $1.79. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Schlumberger Limited. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 1.6%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $41.61. For a vertical put option, an estimated price is at $0.12. AOG Resources was a previous top buy alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it long. You can observe that AOG Resources is a trade normal class. In the past, it has given an average buy return of 0.8%. You may expect now a buy return of 3.7%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $126.28. On the other hand, we suggest to stop buying if the price is $121.75, unless it's undervalued. Philips 66 company was a previous top buy alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it long. You can observe that Philips 66 company is a bull high class. In the past, it has given an average buy return of 0.6%. You may expect now a buy return of 1.6%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $97.96. On the other hand, we suggest to stop buying if the price is $95.07, unless it's undervalued. This is a new buy suggested iron condor option. On the table, Valero Energy has a sell put strike price at $105, a buy put strike price at $108, a buy call strike price at $127, and a sell call strike price at $130. This spread option will expire on October 21, 2022. And the estimated price is at $0.23. This is a new buy suggested vertical put option. On the table, financial sector ETF has a sell put strike price at $30.5. 
and a buy put strike price at $32. For this spread option, it will expire on October 21, 2022, and the estimated price is at $0.48. Let's look at the stock's table of financial sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy Charles Schwab. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 4.1%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $73.1. For vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0.01. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Bank of America. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 11.4%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $31.8. For a vertical put option, an estimated price is at $0.05. Real estate sector ETF belongs to the bear low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of real estate sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy American Tower. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 4.8%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $196.67. For a vertical call option, an estimated price is at $1.62. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Simon Property Group. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 6.7%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $97.71. For a vertical put option, an estimated price is at $0.46. Healthcare sector ETF belongs to the trade normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of healthcare sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. This is a new buy suggested vertical put option. On the table, Johnson & Johnson has a sell put strike price at $165, and a buy put strike price at $167.5. For this spread option, it will expire on October 21, 2022, and the estimated price is at $0.95. Medtronic PLC was a previous top buy alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it long. You can observe that Medtronic PLC is a trade high class. In the past, it has given an average buy return of half a percent. You may expect now a buy return of 0.7%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $83.31. But we expect a possible sell price of $84.29. On the other hand, we suggest to stop buying if the price is $82.22, unless is undervalued. Industrial sector ETF belongs to the Bolo class. Today. Our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of industrial sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Honeywell Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 2.8%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $177.81. For a vertical put option, an estimated price is at $2.16. Caterpillar Corporation was a previous top buy alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it long. You can observe that Caterpillar Corporation is a bull low class. In the past, it has given an average buy return of 0.9%. You may expect now a buy return of 0.3%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $182.89, but we expect a possible sell price of $184.38. On the other hand, we suggest to stop buying if the price is $179.65, unless is undervalued. This is a new buy suggested butterfly option. On the table, 
Emerson Electric has two buy call strike price at $79 and at $81 and a sell call strike price at $80. This spread option will expire on October 21, 2022 and the estimated price is at $0.13. This is a new buy suggested vertical put option. On the table, Union Pacific has a sell put strike price at $195 and a buy put strike price at $197.5. For this spread option, it will expire on October 21, 2022, and the estimated price is at $0.8. Material sector ETF belongs to the trade high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of material sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. discretionary sector ETF belongs to the bear low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of discretionary sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell McDonald's. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 4.5%. You may sell at a minimum price of $243.56. For vertical put option, an estimated price is at $0.76. Amazon Incorporated was a previous suggested long stock. Today, we suggest to sell it. This is a new buy suggested vertical put option. On the table, Starbucks Corporation has a sell put strike price at $88 and a buy put strike price at $89. For this spread option, it will expire on October 21, 2022, and the estimated price is at $0.38. Consumer Staples ETF belongs to the trade high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of Staples sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell Procter & Gamble. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 1.9%. You may sell at a minimum price of $128.15. For vertical put option, an estimated price is at $1.24. Costco Wholesale was a previous top buy alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it long. You can observe that Costco Wholesale is a very low class. In the past, it has given an average buy return of minus 0.1%. You may expect now a buy return of 1.8%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $474.95. On the other hand, we suggest to stop buying if the price is $463.67, unless is undervalued. This is a new buy suggested butterfly option. On the table, Kraft Heinz Company has two buy calls strike price at $34.5, and at $36.5, and a sell call strike price at $35.5. This spread option will expire on October 21, 2022, and the estimated price is at $0.39. Technology Sector ETF was a previous top buy alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it long. You can observe that Technology Sector ETF is a trade high class. In the past, it has given an average buy return of minus 0.6%. You may expect now a buy return of 0.1%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $120.46, but we expect a possible sell price of $121.56.
On the other hand, we suggest to stop buying if the price is $118.74, unless it's undervalued. Let's look at the stock's table of technology sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy applied materials. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 3.7%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $80.59. For vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0.07. On the other hand, there is a weak opportunity to sell NVIDIA Corporation. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 4.0%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $118.49. For vertical put option, an estimated price is at $1.28. Qualcomm Company was a previous suggested long stock. Today, we suggest to sell it. Communication Sector ETF belongs to the trade high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stock's table of communication sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell Comcast Corporation. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 2.2%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $30.82. For vertical put option, an estimated price is at $0.35. Utility sector ETF belongs to the bear low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stock's table of utility sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy Nextera Energy. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 0.0%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $76.3. For vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0.22. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Bitcoin was a previous top buy alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it long. You can observe that Bitcoin is a trade normal class. In the past, it has given an average buy return of 1.0%. You may expect now a buy return of 2.5%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $20,071, but we expect a possible sell price of $20,058. On the other hand, we suggest to stop buying if the price is $19,090, unless is undervalued. Let's look at the cryptocurrencies table. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a weak opportunity to sell Cosmos. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 11.1%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $12.12. Cosmos was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Cosmos is a bare normal class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 1.4%. You may expect now a sell return of 11.1%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $11.2, but we expect a possible buy price of $10.84. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $12.61, unless is overvalued. Monero was a previous top buy alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it long. You can observe that Monero is a trade normal class. In the past, it has given an average buy return of 1.5%. You may expect now a buy return of 2.6%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $147.48, but we expect a possible sell price of $152.69. On the other hand, we suggest to stop buying if the price is $143.76, unless is undervalued. NEO is a previous suggested long cryptocurrency. Today, we suggest to sell it. 
This ends the analysis of our team that gives you a good start on your trading day. Please, remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Share it and leave it a like if you find it useful. Thanks for following us. We hope to see you on our next Just Trading video. Bye.